Alright guys, what's up? It's Catfish Hunters. And today we're going to be dissecting my catfish bag. Alright, let's start with the little pouches on the side, then we'll move our way into the main pouch. So what we have here is some rags and towels so when we get our hands dirty we can get the towel wet and then clean off our hands. And then over here what we have is this fish gripper. This is what we use for channel cats mainly and we'll stick it in their mouth because we don't want to put our hands in the channel cats mouth because they're a lot stronger. They have like a stronger jaw than flathead catfish so we'll put this in the channel catfish's mouth especially if it's a bigger fish and we want to get a picture. And then we have PVC tubing and this is for getting out of snags. I'll explain this in another video. It's basically to help you get out of a snag the only thing you're going to end up losing is your hook. And then now in this front pouch we have our line. This is for our leader line, 50 pound of mono. And then also in here we have our pliers and our scissors. And the scissors is to cut the mono filament. Now we're going to move into our main pouch. So, in here, we have another bag, and in this bag stores our headlights and our braid cutters. So we have three headlights in here, and here is, oops, here's our braid cutters. Also has a little LED light on it, looks like the battery is dead. And then here's our third light this is our headlight and then also we store batteries in here nothing else in here we really use there's some spare um, pliers in here there's a bobber in here this was for our channel catfish bag when we would go wade and we've kind of converted it to flathead catfishing so that's what's in this bag and then next we have our knife and this is just a Rapala knife and you can just this is for cutting like our bait fish like our shad, bluegill, carp and all of that. Next up we have some gloves. These barely get used. Actually really never. This is just for say if someone doesn't want to stick their hands in the flathead's mouth they don't want to get their hands scratched up. That's what those are for. Then we come to our tackle, we got our hooks in here, next we have all of our sinkers, swivels, sinker bumps, and lastly we have our scale, this can weigh up to 110 pounds it looks like, yes 110 pounds, and that is what we have in our catfishing bag so we've got headlamps spare batteries for the headlamps braid cutters pliers a knife leader line then we got our scissors for the monofilament rags to clean our hands fish grips for the channel catfish PVC to help us get out of snags gloves if someone doesn't want to put their hands in the catfish's mouth then we have our terminal tackle. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful. If you guys did find it helpful, make sure to drop a like down below and subscribe for more catfish action. Thanks.